You and I both share a love of dogs. Uh, we often exchange pictures of Harlow and, and I, I adore Harlow. I think we're going to get a picture up here. You're, she's just like the cutest dog ever. I mean, you're a nice person. I like you and all, but my favorite thing about you might be Harlow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, French Bulldog obsessed. Um, I have a head cover that Seamus made me of Harlow's face all over the putter cover. So now we have the Frenchie and the baby and we're still waiting at 13 months for them to like become best friends. You know, they they don't neither really care about each other right now. They are just kind of ships passing. So I'm waiting for the moment where either Henry or Harlow's like, you're my dude, but currently, uh, currently not the case. Uh, I, 13 months old, don't really care about anything except walking around and pointing and stuff. It's weird. Yeah. I think once Henry gets to a point where he's able to ride Harlow, they'll have that like avatar moment where they connect <laughs> to each other. Henry and it'll be fine. Harlow. They just get a brace for this little French bulldog. Um, yeah, it, it'll, it'll be interesting. They both love, I will say, both my children, including the puppy, uh, are obsessed with balls and golf balls and tennis balls. So and I feel like them, if they're sure. ever going to be the synergy, that's going to be it. Is there going to be, you know, Henry throws it, Harlow brings it back, Henry throws it, Harlow brings or, it back. Or it. you throw it and they might both go fight over who's going to bring it back. That too. Yeah. <laughs> fight, fight. Please fight, uh, fight calmly and responsibly is the hope. Yeah. But yes, fight for it if you want.